We're okay. gonna start our Kasei Tata Khema. Okay. okay. Kasei Tata Khema? So, exactly. Ooh, you see, we love it. We love get it that. now. Yeah. Oh, he's on that side. No way. So we cute. Love that. Look at our own mics. Oh my god, Sorry. guys. I feel so important right now. Oh, you are, babe. Do we get our own mic? It's yours. I love it's labeled. Test, test. <laughs> <laughs> There's a whole single, an EP mid-podcast. She's like, yes. Obviously, we're in a safe space. Okay. That's given. We, okay. I want to make it a pinch safer. Okay. And we're going to remove bad vibes. Okay. 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 So we're going to take a salt shaker. And we're going to get a little salt shaker. Okay. okay. Pass them on. Pass them along. Can I have one? We're going to put a pinch on our left hand. A little, little. Left? Left hand. Oh, oh shit. Be, sis. But I'm a righty. You know what? We'll just say vibes oh, and go with vibes. it. <laughs> left hand. Yeah. You got it? Yeah. Got it. And we're going to... And we're done. Okay. okay. You're Woo! done. And we're going to... So obviously, salt is a big part of the community. Yeah. And we value community a lot. Yeah. So the whole concept behind doing a salt podcast was a way to interact with the community. <laughs> I love that. I love how we're starting off with... Guys, no, said, don't start. Don't start. She I said can't. bad vibes are gone. No, no, don't yeah, start. Really. Oh, we put them on timeout. <laughs> can we do some affirmations <laughs> first? Guys, we can. Affirmation. Guys, affirmations. Which ones love. do you want to do? Okay. No, don't say not. We aced Kase Tatel Chema. We aced Kase Tatel Chema. I vibe with guys, that. That's going to be like a little anthem. Should we do like like little breathing? Like breath Three breaths, yeah. Yeah, yeah. One deep breath in. Deep breath out. One more. <laughs> Don't do it. We have the same nails. Cute. And the theme of salt being all about food. Yeah. Our combo today is going to be centered around <laughs> a menu. We're going to okay. do three courses. Okay. First course is setting up the tent. Where okay. We're going to have cute appetizers. Okay. We're going to do cute little easy questions. Yeah, I, I promise you laugh a lot. I promise. <laughs> okay, I'll personally I make you laugh. Stop. Okay, no, no. I need to be serious. <laughs> Sorry, now. guys. And then we're going to do on the grill, which is going to be a bit more grilling questions. I'm going to get deep into your soul. Okay. But like, don't stress. It's going to be easy. Okay. And then we'll do on the s'mores, which are light, cute, and sweet questions okay. with light, cute, and sweet treats. Okay. Okay? Okay. Let's go. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. So we have our setting the tent little appetizers. Okay. Just want to try Yum. some. Um, if you wanted to open the menu and see kind of what we have installed, you're more than welcome to. Let's do it. Do you want to try the appetizers? Yeah, let's do it. Pass them around. I want to get how. I want to see how you guys feel about it. Ooh, interesting menu. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go first. Tell me, that looks yummy. Yum. Are these mm. potatoes? Yes. Can I have some roasted potatoes? Wait, wait, wait. wait, wait. <laughs> no, no, from no. my hands. <laughs> oh, it's too cute. Oh, romance. It's so cute. We love it. <laughs> I don't want to from your hand. Oh, wow. <laughs> that was rude. Too she said, I can't. She said, nope. Yeah, I don't want it from your hand. It's so good though. Mm. No, but on, on the real, I'll, I'll say one thing for, for a fact. Personally, I love being around siblings, especially sisters. Because I know for a fact, like my journey in creativity would not be the same without my sister. Yeah, same for and sure. I feel, exactly, I was gonna ask like, do you guys feel like your bond has impacted your creative journeys in any way? 100%. Yeah, of course. Yeah. How would you say it's done that for you guys? First of all, supporting each other just really gives us the biggest push. Of course. And knowing that we can be fully ourselves and we have one another to support. And yeah, I just feel like I'm mostly myself when I'm around my sisters because I feel like yeah. I'm in a really safe environment yeah. and I'm like, I'm ready to like flourish and like 100%. you guys can see like all. Blah, blah, blah. I don't know. <laughs> no, no, exactly not. I, but I get that. I get that. I feel like same with like with me, right? I can be on a set with a hundred people, but I'll notice if my sister is missing because I'm like, where is she? Yeah, yeah. 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 I need her to be same, there somewhere. Same. You know oh my what god, I mean? that's so cool that you do this with your sister too. I need to. Yeah, we I'm, get cause, it. Because like, sometimes I'm just like. Just come and watch me. Yeah, <laughs> you know, it's kind of weird. Sad, you also, know? you guys want to have some more, please. Let's do There's it, chicken let's do popcorn in yeah, there. Yeah, I'm here for this. And this cop salad, I swear to God, I have I a vegetarian get friend. This, get this, get this. I have a vegetarian friend and we come just to have this. Okay, can you have one too? Yeah, yeah of course. Please. Sorry, I'm trying to, <laughs> trying to be messy on camera. Okay. But I'm talking. Okay, Rani, talking. you want to share this? I'm going to have like one. and then <laughs> I, I'm going to like... I'm going to have one slice of lettuce. Here. Okay, wait, wait. No, mm. let's share it. Let's share it. Hey, guys, that's busting. Right? Have it with the sauce. Babe, Babe have it with the sauce. Uh, what? Because the sauce is just like normal sauce. Yes. No, it's going to leak. Mm. It's a little juicy. Mm, I need tissues, yeah? 
Get me this. <laughs> little ASMR. So good. That's the way I mean. So fresh. I right? love it. Fresh. It's very refreshing. It's like a little like... Yeah. Having your sister there makes a big impact. 100%. Yeah, 100%. Whenever like I go to like shoots or anything, I get so stressed out. Mm-hmm. But and I just whenever like, my sisters yeah. are there, um, I feel like it's just like a vibe, honestly. Like I don't even think about like the cameras or like, anything. It's yeah, just like, like we just have each other's backs, honestly. 100%. Yeah. Yeah. Like as cringe as, cringe <laughs> as it sounds. It's not cringe though because you realize like many people kind of wish to have that, yeah, that support yeah, yeah, system. Yeah, yeah. yeah, We always get comments like I wish I was like that with my siblings. 100%. Yeah. Yeah. So, like, buddies. Well, we have yeah. just so, I feel like we definitely are. Are blessed, yeah. Alhamdulillah. Yeah. Um, other than each other, of course. What's one thing each of you can't live without? She my sister. Can I, can I go? I can't. Oh, my yeah, sister. Go. Just <laughs> one. <laughs> Just only me. Oh my, my sister. No, my dirty. Fam- she had to like point like that. Straight to her. <laughs> no, Sorry, I feel like you. my family like are literally my number ones, and I feel like I actually wouldn't be like. I wouldn't be stable without them. I feel you. Yeah, like yeah. my dad, my mom, like we all have like family times. Can you like, just throw in Rania? Like, yeah, of course, and Rania as yeah, well. Yeah. Like I just traveled to Paris with her. It was honestly like Love. the best trip of my life. Yeah. How was See, that? What did you guys do? Um, we did everything. We went to shows. Yeah, just, we went for fashion week. So yeah. it was a really nice Love. adventure Yeah, to do this. Yeah. And we're planning something, the three of us. Hopefully soon. soon. Yeah. That we planned so it on the way here. So. You had you yeah. had an answer though. What was your answer? Before they roped you with the whole family thing. <laughs> yeah, you guys, thing. can you give me like I a didn't chance even to talk? Okay, I didn't. I'm giving you, Mike is yours. Okay, wait. So, wait, Tani, first of all, you saw my answer. Yeah, no, I can't live without my family for sure. For and, sure. And uh, my phone. Like, I'll be real. Yeah? That's facts. Yeah, like, who, like honestly. It's like. No, that's, that's true. Yeah, can the, I like answer something like materialistic? 100%. Or do I have to be deep? I can, no, yeah. I'm, like, it's honest. So, like, I would yeah. probably say, like, my bed because I need some nap sometimes yeah. And then, yeah, yeah, you know yeah. so 100% be real at the moment I can't live without <laughs> you got it you got, you got it. it it's coming out I can't live out <laughs> I can't live without my Tarte concealer honestly okay you, you know what I'm gonna be Kim K I'll take like, it yeah. like Tarte I'll take concealer it. is just it you Tarte know? you heard that um, quick thank yeah. you <laughs> promo <Yeah. laughs> contract I feel like all of us creatives, at some point, we've gotten this question. Um, how'd you guys start in social media? But I feel like I care more about the feeling. So how did you guys feel when you first started in, into the social media world? Okay, so basically, Dani and I decided that we wanted to create a blog. Hot. Was it a blog? Yeah, it was like a blog spot. Like, it was like Instagram was just out, right? Like, okay, yeah. Cool. Like, like, it was when, when it first they came out. They were the OGs, basically. Yeah, yeah. we were cute, the cute, OGs. Cute, cute, cute. And we basically backed up Instagram with blog spot. So that people oh, can yeah, remember, we, did that. we had like a full-on blog, and um, like we had like every picture we post on Instagram for yeah. an outfit, we we'd have a blog where we talk about our our, our, our outfit. That is so yeah. cute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was such a like at the time, like it was the, it was a thing. You it know? was a thing. And yeah. do you feel like because you guys were the OGs, there wasn't that much pressure, or like was it fun, or like? Kind of what? What was the energy around you doing it? Was it just excitement and passion? It was fun. It was, it was fun. fun, but it was also confusing because we didn't know what to label it as. Fair. Um, what we live in right now, where like basically we have a lot of options. We can make up a career from what we do. Hundred percent. So basically, right now you can really make money out of it. 100%. It's a full on like job yeah. and you can really evolve yeah uh back then we had no idea what we were doing yeah, we're it was just, just like a for fun thing. Like, yeah you know, just like like spare time you know yeah like, i agree so yeah. it's kind of like, like that that way to kind of release that extra bit of creative energy yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Cute. and then when did you come into it um i feel like i was definitely way later than yeah, like yeah, Rani and younger. yeah 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 well um, that makes sense yeah, yeah. so yeah. i started like doing TikToks like just Ew. TikToks like literally so random like mukbangs and like it wasn't even about <gasps> fashion you know yeah I feel like my TikTok I isn't even that. about fashion at all it's mostly just like random stuff yeah yeah it's calm yeah and then people just started being like really obsessed with me <laughs> <laughs> I don't blame them they did, they can did. we get a close <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I people, don't blame you you were always into like uh, video content yeah like even before TikTok yeah there was like Vine and yeah. there was like a I lot agree. of things like that YouTube you were into channel, but yeah. I feel like TikTok is more like where I could like just do whatever I want I, I feel, feel like yeah. there's no pressure you could just post whatever you want yeah. you know? it's like my safe space so. I yeah. like that <laughs> yeah so just started Hashtag. off with TikTok and now we're yeah. grinding to Insta so. yes and do you feel like from the start to now do you feel the same way do you feel that same lightheartedness or has that changed I feel like it changed right like I feel sense. like 
Like, I feel like with Instagram, at least, like, it changed. Like, you have to be more serious on yeah, Instagram, yeah. you know? Like, it's more professional. But on TikTok, you can mess around and just post whatever. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. I feel like Instagram takes away the personality and then TikTok gives I the agree. personality. Yeah. yeah. I agree. You're more yourself on TikTok, yeah. you know? You can, like, 100%. just do whatever. Yeah. What was you guys' favorite memory growing up or your fondest memory growing up? <laughs> <laughs> Egging people's houses. I was gonna say that. I was gonna say that. Yeah. Yeah. Where would you guys live before here? Yeah, in Dubai. Unfortunately, you went, I don't know if we're gonna in get Dubai? Yeah. yeah, yeah, we did that, bro. It was a, it was a phase, as like a long a, phase, yeah, like as a, a year. side hustle. Like we would yeah, literally yeah. Would people go, like pay you to make at this person's house. <laughs> no, no, we just oh we my god, do it, it for free. Fun. Honestly, it was so much fun. It was so much fun. Oh my god, horrible. Are we allowed to say this? Like, are we gonna get canceled? You guys were young. We were so young. Yeah, but I learned my lesson because one time I remember. We were egging houses and it was a big crew. <gasps> and I egged this guy's, uh, this family's house. And I didn't realize I was standing in the back door. And the owner just comes out and he stands right next to me. And he's like, hi. No! And I freaked out. Trauma. We did. Trauma. Yeah. yeah. But we kept doing it afterwards. <laughs> Speaking of activities, okay. I want us to do one. Okay. 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 So in a second, I'm gonna go behind a secret little stage somewhere here. Okay. Ooh. And I'm gonna ask y'all a question. Okay. Ooh. And you have to answer it truthfully. Okay. Okay. Is okay, the truth right there? No, no, it's, it's just oh, one question. Okay. Okay. Oh, okay. What has been a turning point in your life? Don't answer now. Just have to answer in your mind. Wait. <gasps> oh my God, we love it. Turning point in my life was definitely when I healed my eating disorder. I don't want to go so deep into this, but I struggled with an eating disorder for like 10 years. And the more I went on without healing it, like it just took over my entire life, like every aspect, my work, my, my like everything, just every part of my life, my friends, I stopped going out with people. It just literally took over me. And I just felt like I had no power, like... I had no power at all when it came to my eating disorder. And a turning point was definitely when I started to like actually try and work on myself. I never believed in therapy. I never went to therapy. I always thought it was like, I, it didn't work. But then I actually started going to therapy and I started like trying my best to actually heal it. And when I did, I just like, every aspect of my life like was perfect. My work was back on track. I started my, my everything, just everything, yeah. Okay, so I feel like when I was younger, I was bullied about my size because I was very like, I was a chunky child um, and I used to get bullied a lot. And I feel like at some point, I'm just like, stop it, cut it out. And I just, you know, I got on the grind. I started like eating healthy and I like look back now and I'm like really proud of myself because I used to get up every day after school. I used to jog, eat healthy. And now I'm like, I'm happy with myself. You, yeah, yeah, and I feel perfect. perfect. I feel much more like confident and like just healthy in general. And I feel like shout out to the bullies because without you, I wouldn't, wouldn't be, be here. here. Let's go. So I've had a lot of turning points. Uh, one that has really made a big change um, was in COVID. Um, I feel like I was not being 100 percent creative or not putting my creativity out there I decided that I wanted to do a fashion brand I've always knew that I was going to do that because of my mom and like I knew I was always like destined to do that and it was a turning point because creating a fashion brand from A to Z is a lot of work and I feel like I've been like flaky my entire life not committing to something a hundred percent and this was like a baby of mine I gave it my 100 <laughs> I love that all right, so we're going to move on to our on the grill section of our menu. Open it up. Do you guys want to have a look? Oh, you guys are hungry because we're going to eat a, a yeah, little yeah, more. Yeah. Yes. Got you. I, Do see, I see some fries come in. Yes, Ooh. with a big smile. Ooh. Some burgers. And the yes. burgers come Love in. <laughs> what? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if you want a burger. Have you guys seen that Paris Hilton guys, game where she's like, you, everyone, everyone. chill. Yeah, chill. <laughs> <laughs> My girl's opening up conversations. I'm Have you seen that Paris Hilton? Ooh, oh, the corn looks, looks oh, yum. Guys, God. whatever that is in the middle. Okay, I'm actually no. drooling. Okay, yeah. I said I wasn't hungry, but never mind. So yeah. who, who wants to try something me, out me, first? Me, of 100%. Okay. I want to try. So Should what I? is this? You, you more than welcome, but then you have to answer my first question. Okay, fine. Cute? Fine, yeah. Perfect. Let's do it. Okay. But well, you guys, you know, when you're when you're done, like I'm so coming. Oh, that looks so Stop juicy, one guys. Wow. One bar. That Hers look yum. looks so juicy. I need tissues. Oh, okay. We got you tissue. Oh, 
Where is the tissue? My girlfriend. Emergency. <laughs> you? you got it. I would say, I see on TikTok a lot where we talk about really deep um, themes but over like a funny audio. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or like we'll say something like really yeah. like traumatic but like we're dancing to it. Yeah, yeah, you know yeah. what I mean? Do you feel like as a generation, we use comedy to deal with our suppressed emotions? A hundred percent. But I'm not totally like against it because sometimes like you just It's need good to, to like, you know, just you know, have a laugh at things and then way. like, yeah. you know, just try to not make it bigger in your head. hundred like, percent. Yeah. So like, I'm like 50-50. Like I could support it and then I can not support it if it's like too dark. Okay, like looking at past experiences and just like feeling so sad about it. Yeah. In my opinion is like useless you know you can, you can look back at it and just like make fun of yourself like 100%. i think that's what i do with myself you know yeah how was the food how was the bites we violated this Wait, why, why you even... all right Ani, i'm so invested why did you get this out like did I you do to... something wrong why no mm. oh yes that Wait, reaction wanted... was so <laughs> genuine <laughs> how good <laughs> Allah, um. <laughs> Allah, Allah, Allah. Sarada. Ooh, she said good luck. <laughs> How are the flavors? The flavors are melting in my tongue. Yummy. The flavors were so good. Oh my god, honestly. Was it, was this it is salty my favorite. enough? Why is the bread crispy? I'm just so confused. It's I so they, good. I think they grill it. It's so good. Run. This yeah. is my favorite, Hatani. Here you mm. go. Thank you. I remember when I was starting out, somebody much more experienced than me told me it was important to know what I would and would not post. Like it was important for me to make my own rules. Mm. Yeah. It's the same for you guys where like you tell yourself, listen, this thing, no matter what happens, I won't post it on my social media. Is there a thing where you're like, I won't post that ever? Like I post, like I take like, let's say 50 TikToks a day, okay? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I love TikTok. <laughs> I'd post like two because 48 of them would look so cringe to me. I just can't stand it. Or like I'd post something and then I'd look back at it and I would just delete it instantly because I get this like ick. The so ick. Is, is your thing like icky TikToks? You wouldn't post icky TikToks? Cringe we just TikToks. cringe out at a lot of things. Yeah. Like, I feel like cringe is holding us back from our potential. Okay, but, <laughs> potential, but yeah. wow, what, word. what is your cringe criteria? Like what makes you cringe? Or what would you say is your cringe? Like if this is in a video, I'm just... I mm, know, I know. Can go I for answer? It. Yes, when please. When someone's not being themselves. And you oh yeah. my God. <laughs> yeah. Guys, high five. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. For sure, for sure. Yeah. Anything that, that, that you feel like is not authentic is so, a no for you guys. It's yeah. a no, yeah. Yeah. yeah, and we always like Yanni. We always point that out, you know. Like yeah. if something just doesn't feel like real, we'll yeah. just always point that out. Like for instance, one of those people that have like, it's sometimes it's weird because some people have this like really introverted persona when you meet them, but then on camera they're like, "Hi guys, welcome yeah. to like you know," yeah. and it does work out. But then yeah. sometimes it's just like that's if, not you. Yeah, like, it feels fake. Trying to, it like, feels fake. Do you feel like men are as supportive as women are when it comes to women empowerment? No, garment? for sure not. No, for sure not. What would you say you would like men to do more within this within this, the the theme of women empowerment? Okay, for me to feel more empowered. I feel like guys are very, very judgmental. Like with Fair. whatever you do, like you sneeze, they'll go like they'll call you like names. Got you. And I feel like it's like very toxic. And I feel like if they could Sorry, like guys. just you know relax a bit. <laughs> If they could relax a bit and like just Tanya you know, went all in. Mm -hmm. No, yeah, it's fair. She, it's like, that came from her heart. <laughs> yeah, like I feel like literally anything, uh, anything a girl does, like she's always judged, like mostly by other men, not yeah. by other girls. Yeah. Obviously, there are girls that are like very judgmental, yeah. but it comes more like from guys. Yeah. So I feel like, um, yeah. So we survived the first two. Yes. We're on the last course Yay. for the s'mores. <gasps> and these are gonna be cute, easy, fast questions. Can I say something? Go for it. We're, We're all dessert, dessert girls. girls. Coming to the table is a <gasps> special rolls. salt. Let's go. Independent treats. <gasps> this is called frozen rose. Okay. It has rose ice cream and frozen yogurt. Let's go. <gasps> let's go. Yeah. Let's go. Let's okay. Go. Are we gonna eat it? To, who wants to open the box? Me, 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 100%. Do it. I'm okay. like a big frozen yogurt girl. Unboxing. Like, I have an addiction. Yes. Do it, do it in the camera. Be like, unboxing. Unboxing. Mm -hmm. Independent treats. How do I open this? This way. Okay. Drum, Drum roll. roll. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Ooh. Oh my god, that looks so good. Oh my god, that's so good. How do we? How do we dig into it? 
So taste I'm gonna, test? Oh. Taste test. Taste test. Guys, I want to be part of this. Oh, sorry, Hattie. Don't leave me out. <laughs> I've only been feeding you this whole time. Are you going to do the owners? I'm Holly, the owner. I'm like, I'm gonna... Wait, but I want that one too. Go for it. You know it. what would be epic? If you like get a bite and then just like stuff it in the cone. cone. That's mm. what I'm doing. Yeah, I think, I think you're, you're doing it right. You grab the cone. Okay, guys. Cheers. Bottoms up. Hold on, wait for me. Yeah, what wait. What can we do to deserve this? Yeah, I'm sorry. So Princess treatment. Right now. Let's go. Cheers. Cheers. Ten, ten. She inhaled it. Let's go. <laughs> Cheers. Whoa. Bottoms up. Mm. Mm. <laughs> There's like, what's that taste? Rose. Ah, so good. With some pistachios. Mm. I love the softness. Yeah. The little bit of sweet, not too sweet. Too good. Right. Do you, like, do you like stuff that, that are like they're like super super sugary? Or? I yeah, love me. Sh- like super yeah. sugary. I love like the sugar the one with the, sh- <laughs> with the chocolate bar. It's perfect for Ramadan because it's not too heavy. Agreed. We love it. Oh. What is something <laughs> you used to hate but Loki love? I'm gonna start with Talia. Okay, so mm. we all know I was a little chubby kid. Nothing yes. new. Um, and I lost weight. <clears throat> and I have a little kersha right now, you know? Yeah. And honestly, I used to hate it, but now I'm just like, like, bless my kersha, because like, it Amen. just got bless me. The bless, bless the kersha. Bless the kersha. Yeah. Hashtag. 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 <laughs> yeah, so I just, honestly, like, I'm not, like, I do go to the gym and all, but my goal used to be to, like, get rid of my kersha, but mm. now, it's just to embrace it. Embrace I it. I got yeah, you. Yeah, and honestly, Bars. I'm, like, very happy. What about you? Mine would be definitely socializing. I used to be antisocial for like 10 years. I never went out. I always, mm. I, I just hated the idea of going out even with my family. And then recently, I, I'm i just like life of the party, you know? Yeah. I'm going out you all the time. You are that. Like, since, you, since you la- like landed, I mean, since you got here, you were like… Landed. Yeah, yeah I just you know, love it. But- like I used to feel so awkward, but now I just love it. I like… I do, I do it every day. I love seeing people. It's I my love thing. That. Yeah, yeah, when I have friends, I always tell my friends, you have to meet Dania because she's literally like a comedian. I'm not even joking. Yeah. Want, it's, it's not personal, Dania. No, I, I know. I just like, I, I don't know what to do anymore. <laughs> <laughs> They've been well, doing the me so sister. dirty. Wala. Yeah, she is. Wala, wala. What, what do I have to offer? <laughs> 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 oh, I love you. I love you. She is not going to be able to do it. She is not going to be able They suit you. Huh? <laughs> so basically, I thought I liked bangs yeah. at an early age. And then I cut my bangs and um, I was like kind of bullied. Yeah. And I never wanted to see them again. And now I'm like kind of feeling it. it. Yeah. Feeling it. I love the bangs. Oh. I agree. Basically. Yeah. <laughs> For the last question. Let's go. Woo. For the last question. <laughs> I, want, I want my sister to actually ask it for me. Do you mind? I miss my sister now. Oh, she's come here. On, come on. Ahlan, ahlan, ask it for me. Do you want to ask warm. it? <laughs> I've been sitting on this seat for an hour. Hi, guys. Hi. 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 Last question. Like, yeah. Okay, go for it. Can you hear me? <laughs> okay. So basically, since I feel left out, I'm going to ask the most important question. Oh my God. Oh my God. I don't know if it really is most important, but I'm going to say it's most important. Okay? okay. A bit louder. Okay. So if there was any survival advice to give to homes with like two or more sisters, what would you guys give? Can I answer? Go for it. I would Daryl. just say, honestly, lock your door. <laughs> of Dania. No, I have you to like- lock my door because this girl, I have to lock my house. Not just <laughs> my door. No, because, okay, basically it's like a circle. I steal, st- I don't steal stuff. I ask, I always ask. Okay, first thing is lock your door. Second thing <laughs> on the most more positive side is honestly like enjoy every moment of it because Amen. I feel like Amen. me and like my sisters just got close recently. Mm-hmm. Like not recently, like four or five years ago, but whatever. Anyways, um, I feel like like before I never used to chill with them. I never used to like really go out with them and I thought they were like bus kills or whatever. But now <laughs> we're all BFFs. We're, we're all BFFs. We're all buddies forever. Yeah. And honestly, I would just say like enjoy it as much as you can because they're your sisters or brothers, yeah. you know? Did you guys Amen. always get along like this though? Because I know um, we no. didn't. No, I feel like we did. With, with me, I got along with both of you, like yeah. always. No, no, but you and I have been like thunder buddies for life. Yeah. No? Oh, yeah, true. Like, like every, never like, yeah, 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 no, but like Talia, like, I just feel like it was just because of the age gap. Oh, yeah. yeah. Otherwise, we were like always OG. Like, yeah. 100%. Yeah. yeah. I feel like okay, that's the biggest cute. issue about. Yeah. Cute. Well Yay. done. Thank you guys for having a little Thank chat you. with Thank me. Thank you.
I hope you enjoyed it all. Loved it. Thank you for Thank coming. Thank you so much. Thank you. Guys, here's to sister. Little, little oh, guys, let's copy them. Yes. Come on. Let's Hello. Like sister. Like sister. 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 She's like, no more she missed. Okay. <laughs> Thank you for watching. See you on Thank the next you episode. Thank you so much. Peace. Happy salting. Thank you.